Well, I hope everybody's surviving the Corona apocalypse. Uh, welcome back to my channel. Uh, so uh, today, I think I um, I did kind of came to me a little bit ago. I've been getting posts on Facebook about uh, guys are getting shot in the face while turkey hunting. And then there was a guy uh, about a month or so ago got shot twice coyote hunting. I don't know if he made it or not. I hope so. Um, common sense. All right. If it ate your land, stay off of it. If you're not supposed to be there, don't go there. Game lands. Uh, I know that's public access. Um, in some states, are not you're not required to wear orange or red. Which, um, and I, I mean, I understand too. I mean, turkey hunting, you know, you want to be full camo because they, turkeys can see that stuff. Um, but no, there's a guy, he, uh, was turkey hunting. And from what I understand was they were, they'd, they'd stop to take a break. And, uh, somebody in, was also on the property sorry a minute just found something off of grandpa's tractor uh somebody was also turkey hunting on the same property that wasn't supposed to be there or maybe it was an adjacent property i don't know uh but anyway he was uh gobbler calling they were hen calling and so they decided all right we'll go down here and track this turkey out which is stupid guys don't they call it stalking your prey that is the worst idea ever just because you hear a turkey gobble a coat holler a deer grunt unless you see it you might as well pretend it don't exist because people get trigger happy things happen accidents are made uh, people get shot um, I don't know how much how to be more clear I mean I, I remember growing up we had a we had a problem with trespassers too um, place where we were hunting that had a guy stop us one time said hey you see a white car with an older man and a lady inside I might have told y'all this story I don't know I'm posting videos left and right it's kind of hard for me to keep track of everything but he said, uh, yeah, I stopped. He said, so you see a white car for a man and a woman inside of it. He said, called a game warden. He said, they're up to no good. He said, they've been spotting, spotlighting at night, which in North Carolina and I know several other states, that is illegal. Not only is it illegal, but the way they were doing, doing it too was just a waste. They were just cutting the back strap out of the deer and leaving the rest of it. I mean, a whole deer. And just cutting just six inches off of them and leaving the rest to rot. That, oh man, I guess under my skin more than you, you can know. We had a another problem where we were deer hunting at. Uh, had some horseback riders come in on the property on the land we had leased, which was owned by the same gentleman that owned the other property that I just told you about. He uh, he told us we were the only ones supposed to be down in there, and that nobody else had permission. Well, we had some horseback riders come in and tore down the tree stands and beat the snot out of them, tore them all apart, tore them all apart, just got in there and caused trouble. They went down to the creek, dammed it up, which okay, whatever, made like a little swimming hole. Which okay, fine, whatever. It wasn't deer season wasn't in. I mean, I, I get it. They want a place to ride horses. Okay, fine, whatever. But to go down there and cause all that destruction and everything, people's hard-earned money right there, they just... Mm. Until you've been through it, you don't know. I mean, it's just... Yeah. Yeah, it's... It's irritating. But yeah, I uh, don't normally do this, but this video I think needs to be shared. 
let's make this one go viral if we can because I like I said I mean, I'm I've seen too many accidents getting posted people getting shot um, near accidents I mean guys just be careful out there um, that's all I got for today really um, first day back back at work hadn't got full swing just working on part-time hours but you know hopefully we can get things going here for too long I'm still working on this freaking tree blind or not tree blind, but deer blind, hunting blind. Uh, it's getting to be a pain in my neck, but I'm I'm gonna finish it before it's over said and done. With. We're getting there. We're getting there. Um, there'll be other videos coming soon. Um, maybe try to get some wildlife videos up. See what I can get. Uh, but yeah. We'll definitely get more get more stories told, get more stuff out there. A lot of content coming. Uh, just doing it one day at a time. That's all we can do. Just bear with me. It's coming. I promise. Until then, tune in next time. Thanks.